GMAT Challenge number 26. In the figure shown, AC is 2 and BD and DC is 1. What is the measure of angle ABD? Feel free to pause this video and attempt the problem on your own. Now let's review my solution to this problem. For geometry questions like this, I like to mark the information in the diagram provided. If there is no diagram, then I will construct a diagram according to the description of the problem. First, AC equals 2. So from A to C, it's 2. BD and DC is 1. So BD is 1, DC is 1. That basically tells you that these two line segments, they are equal, even though it doesn't look like it in the diagram. That's why there is a note, not drawn to scale. And it's asking the measure of angle ABD. So mark it angle ABD, you could put a question mark over there. And now I'm going to change the color to mark the information that I can deduce from these pieces of information. The first piece of information I can get is the, le is the length of AD. Since we know that AC is 2, DC is 1, that means AD has to be 1. AD has to be 1. As a result, AD has the same length as DC as BD. So this triangle ABD is actually isosceles triangle. Right, so if I put it over here, so A, B, D is actually a isosceles triangle. If the top angle is 120 degrees, then the two base angles will be 30 each because the sum of all three interior angles of any triangle will be 180 and it's an isosceles triangle so it's very easy to get that the answer is 30 degrees which is C alright that's it for today's challenge I will see you next time bye bye